Hello children, I am Prasanna. In this video, I am going to explain types of angles. Before going to types of angles, first we will discuss about angle. See, we see angles around us all the time, right? Angle is formed between the two rays or two line segments. Here, where an angle is formed? Here, the vertex. This is called vertex. The common end point of the two rays is called the vertex. Here angle is formed and these two rays are nothing but arms or sides. We also say it as sides. Okay. So angles are measured in degrees that you know. And we use what? Protractor. Right. To compare and measure angles we need an instrument called a protractor and it is in the shape of semicircle that you people know what is protractor and how to measure with the protractor. So angle are, angles are measured in degrees. What is that degree? Here it is like this right. Now we see angles almost everywhere in our day to day life. For example angle made by the hands of a clock. minute hand and hours hand angle is formed so in the clock we can see many angles and angle made by two intersecting roads yes angle is formed and angles are made by the blades of a fan angles are formed when scissors are opened Angles are formed at the corner of the wall. So like this, we also use angles for navigation of planes and ships. Okay. Now, here we are going to discuss types of angles. As the angle increases, the name also changes. So today we are going to discuss the types of angles. So in types of angles, first one we are going to discuss acute angle. Acute angle. So an angle whose measure lies between 0 and 90 degrees. So between 0 degrees and 90 degrees. You know what is between. Between means the numbers which are in uh, middle of that 0 and 90. Means 0 and 90 are not acute. Between 0 and 90 are acute. So like 1 degree, 2 degrees, so on up to 89 degrees. This forms acute angle. So definition of acute angle is an angle whose measure lies between 0 degrees and 90 degrees are, is called acute angle. Now if you see the protractor here it will be 0 degrees if it is 180 degrees. Now and you people know here it is 90 right. So here this part between so 0 to 90 so this part is called what acute angle so what is the shape of that angle children if you see the shape it will be like this so these are the shapes so what is the acute angle shape children it is this is 30 degrees 80 degrees so these are all the shapes of acute angle so an angle whose measure lies between 0 and 90 is called acute angle next angle is obtuse angle what is obtuse angle an angle whose measure lies between 90 degrees and 180 degrees means 91 to 179 so 91 degrees 92 degrees so on up to 179 degrees these are all obtuse angles so what will be the shape of these obtuse angles if you see this is 0 degrees and it is 180 degrees and it will be 90 degrees right children so where is obtuse angles here this part is known as obtuse angles. Okay. So between 90 and 180. Then what will be the shape of these angles? If you see here is the baseline. This is the. All these are the shapes of obtuse angles. 
Okay, children. So shape will be like this. 120 degrees. 150 degrees. So all these shapes are obtuse angle. Shapes are also very important, children. So acute is nothing but angle whose measure lies between 0 and 90 is called acute angle. And coming to obtuse, an angle whose measure lies between 90 and 180 is called obtuse angle. Next third one is right angle. An angle whose measure is 90 degrees. Whose measure is 90 degrees is called right angle. So what is the shape of this 90? It is like this. So 90 degrees or 0 is 90. So 90, this this one this one represents what 90 degrees. Okay, children. The, the angle whose measure is 90 degrees is called right angle. Right angle. Next coming to fourth one. Straight angle. Straight angle is nothing but an angle whose measure is 180 degrees. Whose measure is 180 degrees. And it will be straight. Here. So this is the shape of a uh, straight angle. So an angle whose measure is 180 degrees is called what? Straight angle. Next coming to zero angle. An angle whose measure is zero degrees is called zero angle. If the measure is zero then we call it as zero angle. Then shape will be like this. Zero angle. Next one is complete angle. An angle whose measure is 360 degrees and we also call it as whole angle. The other name of this is whole angle. So an angle whose measure is 360 degrees is called complete angle. Then what is the shape of this children? So up 180, down 180. Total 180, 180 gives you 360. 180 plus 180 gives you 360 degrees. So an angle whose measure is 360 degrees is called complete angle. So right angle is nothing but an angle whose measure is 90 degrees. Straight angle is an angle whose measure is 180 degrees. Zero angle is an angle whose measure is 0 degrees. Complete angle or whole angle is an angle whose measure is 360 degrees. Next one is reflex angle. Reflex angle is nothing but an angle whose measure lies between 180, 180 degrees and 360 degrees. Okay children, here if you see this is up 180 and down 180 right. Now here. This is 180 up. That is more than 180. Means all the reflex angles will be in the downwards. 180. So the shape will be like this. So these are the reflex angles. Okay children. So it is above 180. So what will be the shape now reflex angles? Yes. These are the shapes for reflex angles. It is 270, 180 plus 90, 270 like that. So reflex angle is nothing but an angle whose measure is between 180 and 360 is called reflex angle. Once again we will repeat children here. Type of angle, in brief I am writing. Type of angle and its measure. Okay. Now first one, acute. Acute angle. Acute angle is nothing but between 0 degrees and 90 degrees. Next is obtuse angle. Obtuse angle is between 90 and 180. Next reflex angle. Reflex angle is between 
180 degrees and 360 degrees. Next is right angle. Right angle is nothing but an angle whose measurement is 90, whose measure is 90 degrees. We call it as right angle. Next is zero angle. Zero angle is an angle whose measure is zero degrees is called zero angle. Next is straight angle. An angle whose measure is 180 degrees is called straight angle. Next is complete angle or whole angle. An angle whose measure is 360 degrees is called complete angle. Now I will show you in one figure only all these types of angles. Here if you see show with the difference 0 degrees 180 degrees and here it is 90 degrees okay now if you see this is 0 angle and what about this one full acute angles and this is what right angle and what about this all obtuse angles and this 180 is what straight angle and what about this down full one is reflex angles 